It's a very windy day here in Maputo, Mozambique. I've got my Samora Michelle t-shirt on for a visit to his statue, but more about that in just a moment. Maputo is Mozambique's capital city. It's also the most populous city with about 2.7 million people in the metro area. We're going to be touring all of the top tourist sites, so why don't you come along? First stop is the Museum of Natural History here in Maputo, Mozambique. And by the way, Mozambique is an old Portuguese colony. We'll be talking a little bit about that in a moment. A couple of things you got to see. The elephant fetuses, yes I said it, the elephant fetuses, as well as the rare coelocanth. Hang on. This is a coelocanth, and it's extremely rare, thought to be extinct about 60 million years ago. This one was found off the Camorra Islands. The second thing I want to highlight is this rather eerie progression of elephant fetuses up to the size of this guy right here. We are now in Workers Square and that statue is the only Portuguese colonial era statue out on public display. This is the Central Railway Station, constructed between 1908 and 1916 in the Beaux-Arts style. A lot of people believe this is one of the prettiest in the world. This is the Fortress of Maputo, and in a moment I'll show you what's stored inside. Fascinating story. After a really ugly break with uh, colonial power Portugal, the People's Republic of Mozambique started in 1975. After independence, the statues of Portuguese heroes were removed from the capital and stored right here in the fortress. This one used to sit at the top of Independence Square. The statue of Samora Michel, Mozambique's first elected president, sits there now, and we'll talk more about him in just a moment. By the way, after 1975 independence, most of the city streets, originally named for Portuguese heroes, had their names changed to African languages, revolutionary figures, or pre-colonial historical names.
Here's the statue of Samora Michelle in Independence Square. A 30 foot tall bronze statue was made in, ready for this, Pyongyang, North Korea. It was inaugurated in 2011, about 25 years after he died in a mysterious airplane crash. This is the Cathedral of Our Lady of Immaculate Conception in downtown Maputo. Foundation stone was laid in 1936 and construction was finished in 1944. What do you say we go inside, take a look? The Tunduru Gardens Public Park in downtown Maputo was designed back in 1885 by a British gardener named Thomas Hani. Casa de Ferro, or as it's known, Iron House, was prefabricated in Belgium and brought to Mozambique. This 1892 building was to be the Portuguese governor's residence, but without air conditioning, it was almost impossible to live and work here. This is the San Antonio Catholic Church, also known as the Lemon Squeezer built with a lot of concrete and some very delicate steel. 